DJs, glow sticks, and party tricks. These rave style parties have been all the rage for years along St. Pete's Skyway Bridge. DJs just come out and they set up for free. Uh, tens of thousands of dollars of equipment they bring out and just have a good time. But Florida Highway Patrol is putting an end to the parties starting December 3rd. Gates will block off entry to the rest stops from sunset to sunrise. Evans, one of the many DJs, says the community is upset about it. And we're all sad. Um, there's, like I said, I've been with the events for probably the last two or three years, and a lot of people who help put these together are, are kind of upset. Florida Highway Patrol troopers aren't the only ones who want to put a stop to this. It's kite boarders like Karen Minnelli who get here around 7 o'clock in the morning and say sometimes the parties are still going on. When I've arrived, there's oftentimes there's music that's really loud blasting uh, um, from inside the mangroves or on the beach. And um, I have been personally involved in beach cleanups and have picked up a lot of garbage. But Evan says they're not to blame. We, we go around with trash bags, we take all the trash with us and then put it away. Uh, they only have a couple of trash cans out here so we can leave it by them and that's about it. It's not the first time law enforcement is closing off causeways and stops near bridges. Back in 2016, the Florida Department of Transportation installed these gates along the Courtney Campbell Causeway after late night street racers <laughs> put drivers at risk. Here, though, the case seems to be safety and beach cleanliness. It's too bad that we couldn't just all together as a group chip in and do our part. Reporting in St. Petersburg, Jennifer Holton, Fox 13 News.